Hi, so I've just finished um, my last little set before I head off to the Sunshine Coast tomorrow um, for the Sunshine Coast 70.3. Um, one of the main questions that I get on, when, when, when talking about the low carb approach is um, what do I do before competition and how do I take that approach? So when it comes up to competition, I actually do increase my carb intake. Um, so this week the race is going to be on the Sunday. So as from um, Thursday night, I'll actually start thinking about increasing the, um, some of the carbs I'm going to be taking into my diet, but that's not to mean to say I'm going to go and start binging on bread and crackers and crisps. I'm just going to increase some real healthy carbs in the form of kumaru, banana, some more of the natural kind of paleo, um, paleo sort of um, sort of solutions. So I'll start that on um, Thursday night, and then Friday morning I'll have a few more. Um, Friday night. Saturday morning and then Saturday night and I'll basically be looking to try and get around 150 grams per day and this is actually based on the study by a, a guy out of New Zealand called, called Roland, Roland's and they actually showed that this was quite an effective way to increase performance in the more low carb fat adapted, fat adapted athletes. Um, so then coming into race morning what I generally do is I'll actually not have any carbs on that morning so what I'm trying to do there is I'm trying to make sure that I really don't spike any insulin and, and, check and turn off any fat burning at all. Um, so generally I'll actually just have a couple of eggs and maybe um, and maybe one of these kind of super starch, um, super starch slow absorbing carbohydrate dr drinks and beverages that you can actually get because um, that's been shown that it doesn't have, have an effect on the insulin and it doesn't really turn off the fat adaptation. So um, there's some of the things that I do um, and then and I'll be talking again and this is a first part of this series and I'll have another second part where I'll actually be talking about then what I actually do during the race and during Ironman and 70.3 is when taking more of a low carb approach. Um, if you like these um, TV extracts and you want to see more then just click on the link below and subscribe to the S Fuels TV channel.